boom hi youtube family good morning happy today's sunday for me i don't know when my videos go up but i still in my pajamas just this morning i woke up feeling brand new i jumped up feeling my highs and my lows my face still sleepy anyways if you haven't purchased my knife set, make sure you make your way over to lovelymaymay.com. You get one, two, three, four, five, nine, one scissor. Have my name engraved all in there. As you see, Lovely May May, no math for you. Thank you very much. Hurry up and buy. Today, we're going to be victim. P-H-O. So today, we're going to be victim for. I'm going to show you what the fuck is about. My button, my button. Okay, here's the pop. Ah! All right, let me show you all of the meat that we're gonna be using today. I don't have to move it over here because it's like bloody. big pot we are gonna have beef neck bones these were ten dollars from the 99 ranch and these are more meaty to me for neck bones they're very fucking meaty wash that blood out so i throw it in the trash Give them a little knife. We have a pack of oxtails right here. And these were $18. Which I feel like the neck bones are way more meat than the oxtail. And then. I have a pack of pork bones. So you know what? I think it'd be cockatiel because I think Cambodian bones be like either pork or beef. The bone mixer. Soup. And we're not done because we have a pack of beef ribs also. Alright, so this is all the meat, the ribs, everything. We're going to fill this up with water. And we're going to boil this for like 20 minutes and then we're going to wash it out again. Okay, so this is just going to be filling instead of washing. Y'all know what I mean. It's a lot of meat. I'd be feeling like I need a bigger pot, bro. All right, so our meat is in here and it's, we're gonna let it boil, okay? Come to a boil and then we're gonna rinse that. So while that's waiting, let's get our um, other stuff out that we need. I just wanna show you my little waist. <laughs> we're gonna need... Ah. A large onion. We need a large onion, a ginger, and yo, I have this big ass garlic, so like, why not? This big ass garlic thing, why not? And our pack of. So I ordered these from Amazon, y'all. So it's the fall stuff. It has everything you need in it already. Because honestly, if I go in the store and you're telling me I need to get all the ingredients for fuck, I don't know what it is I need. I don't even know what the fuck half of this shit is called. I know cinnamon, cloves, stavonese, and the rest shit I don't know. So you just order this from Amazon and it'll help you out with everything. Okay? So that's going to be for the soup base. Get out our... Big Mama 
chicken. She's somewhere. Almost empty. All right, so we're just gonna... Wait. Okay, so it's been about 20 minutes where the meat is boiling and you see all the gunk is coming up. So we're gonna take this over and we're gonna strain it out and wash the meat and then we're gonna put water back again. So this is just to pull all the impurities, all the dirt, all the nasty stuff, the blood and stuff like that out. So now we're gonna take it over to wash it. So we're gonna take this out one at a time. We're gonna wash it. All right, so right over the burner, we wash the meat, we put it in new water. We're gonna let that come to a boil and then we're gonna turn it on low. But over here, we got the onion. We got this big ass piece of garlic. I was like, why not? And this ginger, and we're gonna lay it right on top of the fire and let that char up. So don't mess with it. Come back, like let it sit for like five minutes, then flip it. Let's see. Shit, that motherfucker fell. Come here. That's small. Leave it right there. All right, so we put our onion, our ginger, and you know what? It doesn't have to stay in the whole time. You can just put the ginger for as long as you like tasting. I'm not going to have it in for a long time. Maybe an hour or so, I'm going to remove it. And we're going to close the top and let this cook. Let it come to a complete boil before we turn it down. And while it's cooking, it's going to start building scum on the top. And you're just going to scoop that out. You know, occasionally. It's a process. Yes? Pho? Yeah. Yeah. Not ghetto. What do you want me to make pho? Kiteo. Now I'm about to run and take Javon to get his hair cut. So we're going to turn this down and we're going to close Actually, the top. let me do this before I step out. So this bag come from Amazon. I showed you guys earlier. Bet you one of these. Put it on a hot pan. And we're going to toast it. Now this, you can smash it, get all the flavor out. I don't really like it too strong, so I'm not going to smash it. But we're going to toast this. And, and the baggie comes with a bag. So it comes with a little baggie like this. So you can um, transfer over. Once it finished toasting. All right. So now that it's toasted, we're going to put it in this bag. Alright, tie this. 
Babe, I gotta run to Javon. Uh, take Javon to go uh, his haircut. And I gotta run to Stater. I need to get some steak. And I'm pick up Annie a cake. All right, now we're gonna drop the bag into the broth with everybody. All right. Seep it down there. Close it back up on low for like three right, hours. Let me show you guys the vegetables. We're gonna have culantro. This is my favorite. Then we have basil, green onion, cilantro, bean sprout, and then we got some red onion and some instead of jalapeno pepper, I'm gonna use serrano pepper. So we're gonna go ahead and start washing everything. All right. Okay, now we are gonna cut up our green onion. it onto our plate and then we have our cilantro Good, looking good. All right, so we got serrano peppers. I already cut up, chopped up two. I was like, between the jalapenos and serranos, I'm like, let me go with serranos. I feel like they're more spicy. Okay, then we got a red onion that we're gonna use. to get my nails done tomorrow because I still hold my hand like how I have long nails like I'm not accustomed to holding it like how with short nails and I'd be forgetting there's certain it's like a whole different way so our plate is looking scrumby lumptious look at that okay time to season we have these beef bouillon they come in this little cube Loud. sorry guys it was loud and um, I'm doing this with one hand as you can see <laughs> we're gonna drop this in beef cube then we're gonna get some big mama chicken okay we're going to take some pink salt. I already put some, so that's why I'm not putting a lot, as you can see. Fish sauce. I'm just showing you what you should put. MSG. You, if you have rock sugar, that's good. I thought I had palm sugar. I can't find it, but you can use regular sugar. Give that a mix. We're gonna let this sit for like a few minutes, then we're gonna start removing some of the meat because I don't want the ribs to like completely fall off the bone. And taste it. Let's see. Mmm. 
That's good. Oh, I also removed the ginger. I took the ginger and the seasoning pack out and the because it can get really strong. <sighs> Taste it. Oh yeah, that's good shit. That's good shit. Alright, I didn't want these beef ribs to like get too tender because they're already tender and when they're too tender it's like blurry they don't they won't even be on the bone anymore so i took them out we're gonna cut them and set them aside Ooh, so hot Okay, it's been about four hours, and now we're gonna start removing the meat into a separate because we gotta strain the broth. Yeah. And Javon over here digging in there. Ooh, look at that fat. We're gonna run this through a strainer. Alright, you're gonna get your strainer and you're gonna pour. You need all that out too? We're gonna strain it one more time. We're gonna take it from this pot to that pot. Twice? Get up on your good foot. Okay, one more time. Now switch. Put that there and then grab this. So you're gonna strain it two two times, guys. All right, so we have some of these Vietnamese meatballs. These ball bean, these ball meatballs. Cut them in halves. Drop these in the pot. All right, I got a filet mignon. I put it in the freezer because they told me when you keep it in the freezer, it's easier to cut thinner slices. We got us a filet. And we're gonna cut thin slices. This is for our thigh. Look at that. Cute. I also got a ribeye. So we're gonna thin these slice this also.
think I need all of this meat, so I'm going to save this big ass. Well, I don't need that one piece. noodles you guys so we're gonna put them in a strainer and then into the hot water it goes and this is gonna allow the noodles to cook not too long because you don't want it to overcook strain it out into a bowl now we make our way over you want some uh, filet mignon Sure. Put the ribeye on top. Now the meat is thinly sliced, so it's gonna cook. <laughs> Bless you. Sorry. And Thank you. Here, you guys. It's her birthday this weekend. Okay. And now we have the broth. Let's go check out the broth. Hot, boiling meatballs. You know, I thought I got you an oxtail, but now I'm thinking that I got you something else. And we have a beef rib up in here. Oh, yes. Give me my first time. <gasps> you never had a beef rib? Never. Ooh. Now, would you like bean sprout? Yes. Bean sprout? Would you like? Basil. Everything. Basil leaves. Basil leaves. Basil leaves. This is culantro. I love culantro. This is my favorite. Some red onions. Scallion and cilantro. A little bit of sabonet. What the fuck is that? <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> Lemon. And then. Let's head over here to your peanuts. Do you like chili oil, ma'am? Yes. I know, I hate these peanuts. It's so stupid. A little sriracha? Yes. Oh, oh yes. I don't know how much you want. Okay, you sit next to Jayvon. Go ahead, Annie. Go ahead, Annie. Oh, let me get your chocolate. Thank you. Okay, go ahead, take your picture. I didn't even give you oxtail. I thought they gave you oxtail. It was a beef bone. That was a neck bone. You want a beef bone or oxtail? You can share this beef bone with me because it's huge. Um, so hot. Juicy Kylie! About to make the kids, the rest of the kids' bows. All fucking morning. <laughs> I won't know. I started at three o'clock, which isn't bad. Tastes better than the restaurant. Pick it up and bite it. You should. Mm -hmm. Look like a princess. <laughs> oh my god! It's so tender. Falls right off the bone. Yeah, I tried to take it out before. I didn't want to fall off completely because then it don't be on the bone anymore. Oh my god, that's really good. Thank you. Munch time. It's yummy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, I didn't even ask him. I gave him chopsticks, huh? No, no. Hey, fine. 
，放了泡泡。嗯，超级鸡心。Mmm, yummy! I don't even know if this oxtail is soft enough. Oxtail be taking a long time. The beef rib cook way faster. Whew. How are we turning, Annie? Forty-two. Yeah, you look great, little Annie. She looks so good. Forty-two. Forty-two. Then you not much older than me. So dumb. Now I feel like I look old. <clears throat> I know you know. Ooh, hot. I felt old yesterday. I'm losing. I'm tired. Cheese. I'm gonna get Cheese. Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Annie. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Make a wish, old lady. She looks so old. Lady, you just ruined my whole Right? Annie looked great for her age. I forgot about my wish. One, two, three, four. Yay!